Hi, Rich. Hope you're doing well. Recovering from the time you had uh, out of town. I just wanted to quickly go over the proposal with you, uh, walk through some of the points I think we should highlight. So as we scroll through here, I think what you'll find is I've got the effective date set for the 4th. I think that was in line with uh, one of your policies. Where we, I mean, that's adjustable, so don't sweat that. As we scroll through here, uh, some of the billing options, most folks uh, participate in the monthly electronic with, or electronic funds transfer, is what EFT stands for. And that is just uh, monthly payments uh, charged to your bank checking account. And to do that, you just need the one month to get started. So, all right. And here is uh, the total premium. They put that up front. The custom protector, which is the general liability and the property coverage is the 1500. The auto is the 3000. And just keep in mind that that auto coverage is uh, four times in most situations greater than the current coverage you have with progressive uh, and less expensive. Uh, now we get into the breakdown of different coverages with the property. Uh, Inland Marine is all of your contractor's equipment. All right, we can talk about that one. Uh, general liability right here at 995. And uh, add them together, you get the 1500. And then here's the auto. So let's take a look at what we've got for the contractor's equipment. So $5,300 in total when it comes to the pieces at uh, under a thousand bucks. So that's where we multiply that plus the $300 in the tools. Okay. Uh, the deductible is set at $1,000. We can adjust that if we need to. Um, and then here's all your bigger stuff right here. So that's all of your items that are over $1,000 with a $500 deductible. So um, anyway, I wanted to go over that. Here's the million dollars in coverage and liability. Very standard for contractors. And then here's how the premium is based, you as the owner, and then the $58,000 per year in employee payroll. Now, don't need to spend a lot of time going through uh, these other options, but that's basically a whole bunch of just tossed in coverage that may be valuable, may not, but hey, it's what it comes with. And there's some things in here that are good that you'll never really know <laughs> what the heck it is. The value of it is until there's a claim or something like that happens. So uh, we do have hired and non-owned auto coverage, which means that if your employees are ever driving their own personal vehicle for you just to make an errand or whatever, uh, that there is the million dollars in coverage for that. Okay, this goes over some of the coverages on the vehicles. Um, some other coverages here with the vehicles. Policy does come with towing and labor. Okay, that's one of the things that it included. And where's the other coverage? Rental reimbursement right here. So that's a good endorsement. It's 50 cents a month to include that endorsement, so that's pretty good. And then the rest of it, as we scroll through here, is all really not applicable. So wanted to give you a quick rundown. Uh, so I walked through some of that stuff. We can certainly do it over the phone, but there you have it, sir. Uh, happy Friday.